Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if the Xbox app is not downloading or installing games onto your Windows 11 computer. This tutorial will apply for Windows 10 and Windows 11 devices that are running the Xbox application. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu, type in apps, Best match to come back with apps and features. Go ahead and open that up. In the search apps field, type in Xbox. Best match on the right side should say Xbox. Select the three dotted icon that appears next to it and select advanced options. Scroll down underneath where it says reset. If the app isn't working right, we can try to repair it. If the app's data won't be affected, select the repair button. And then you want to close out of here and actually restart your device. And then hopefully that should have been able to resolve the problem. If you're still having an issue, we can try actually resetting the Xbox application. So if you open up the search menu again, type in apps, best match, come back of apps and features. Go ahead and open that up. And you want to go on the right side again and type in Xbox. Same application we were on before. Go ahead and select the three dotted icon and then advanced options. This time we're going to go down to underneath reset. If the app isn't working right, reset it. The app's data will be deleted. So this will delete the app's data. It shouldn't delete anything if you backed up to the cloud or if you're using your Xbox. This is just merely the Xbox application on your Windows device. So select reset. This will permanently delete the app's data on this device, including your preferences and sign in details. Select reset. And then again, once you have a check mark next to the reset button, close out of here and then restart your computer once again. And then hopefully at this point your issue should have been resolved. If you're still experiencing a problem, something else we can try here is running a system file tracker utility scan. So in order to do that, open up the search menu and type in CMD. Best result should come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now into this elevated command line window, you want to type in SFC followed by space forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Go ahead and hit enter on your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take a couple minutes to run, so please be patient. And once that's done, go ahead and close out of here and restart your computer.
Okay guys, so now hopefully at this point, when you're using your Xbox Windows application, you should be able to download and install games successfully. So, as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.